Hi, what's up everybody? I am Mac. How do you all? Everyone's. I am very fine and say Namaskar. Repeat Namaskar in comments below. So, today let we have to take a look about a tiny tutorial in Photoshop. It's a very basic thing but it looks very cool. If you are a Photoshop lover then this is the video for you. So, usually you have a windows in your house and everything. When you are standing nearby the windows and take a good shot in the photograph using camera mobiles or smart mobiles or a DSLR or anything that will be very cool stuff will be there. But when the light rays falls from the window to, to your engine means so how it will be looks like it's make more beautiful to your photograph and everything right the one thing you have to make it as one thing the second one and you have to click the plugin just one click see the magic that's the one let's get started the tutorial watch the full tutorial to get your powerful fine looking light rays in your photograph so and this is my room a window uh, leave leave about these things okay this is the one but i take the shot like this only so how to achieve these ones you have to control your frame rates and the iso in your dslr you can take that if you not have the dslr if you suppose if you do that with your mobile means catch this point press command j to make the duplicate on this picture then press command l to take the levels or you you can take this adjustments level okay command l is the shortcut so the mid tones reduce the full side to the mid tones to the right side so make it zero right that is very cool so bring back to the output levels also a little bit play around these ones when you achieve these things you can press ok like this also so this is my picture so this image size is going to 5000 as a larger one pixels so I moved into the 1080 pixels from here then I work from here to like this and added some grains to this light rays inside this so that is makes very realistic to a look otherwise it when we can be the photoshopped any anyone can be say that so say this a little bit grains inside the light will be there so dust particles or anything you can say so that very easily to make this so i just switch off these layers everyone so i make command j to make a duplicate one I bring it back to this one guy or simply I delete this right okay I just delete this all the things I quickly started from this one so create a new layer with adjustment of gradient in that the gradient you just prefer any color of by colors that is very good so I just take down to anything take it down to the angle so click on the gradient fill check the gradient type to noise wow that's exactly we want see this you can achieve by clicking this randomize also I just prefer on this so once I prefer I check reverse to get the super light that's one then I bring back to the screen mode once I put back in the screen mode I can move the light from where it will be comes out from this that is the cool so I just move over to the right top side of this why because the window shooks left, left side so the light fall from the right sides I just make like this one then I press 
okay to complete this then I switch off this layer first then I come to my original layer take down your polygon lasso tool right then I bring back to the this window side you can see this then I put it make 45 degree like this once to the right then I just make it to a cute mask on this layer okay actually I apply to this layer only then I come to here take your brush tool or fill it with the black then just paint it down on this one this side then press command D to release this selection once you <coughs> sorry once you release the selection then take down to another adjustment layer of you can already know what that black and white picture in that black and white picture I check it to the below affected to the clip layer only then I bring the reds to more you can see this their light rays will get intensity of the light rays is going to increase so increase the red and somewhat yellow not much more bring back to the green layers that is very great and with the cyan with the blues something not much more feel that look something that is very cool then the three layers will comes down to make into the first one right so select the both one command J to the duplicate side and press command E to to make a single layer on this actually merging the layer then again I put it down to the hard light you can see the light rays it will looks like from this so if you put a soft light no nothing will be come out if you overlay no chance multiply nothing will be appeared lighten and hard light that will be appeared in that lighten mode I just apply to the blur to the shape or with the motion blur will be there here the motion blur will be a very much good thing so I take it down to the this 45 degree of the angles a very much little bit only 5 pixels so when I apply I again reapply means command F it is very good then I come back to hot light so once up here press command J and control T make it to the vertical side then you make this thing like this you can make your fit on these pictures and everything it looks good but this is the procedure way of these things but I love to do a single that I, I tell you that the this is the digital film arts DFT race V 2.0 that means version 2 so this is the plugin what I am using in my pictures I officially posted in the Facebook Twitter Instagram and everything that is very cool right watch this see the magic light rays will be play around on your image that is very cool right so I just bring down to this once so this is the interface you have to move your things you can comparison by side by side and everything you can take your snapshot or you can show your mask everything you just need the rays only you can take it out 
or you just need the output that will be missed or any other texture or with a light source and you can blend more the two add scenes in there you can add it or you can screen it here I prefer add why because the light rays it will be fall down from the windows that you can be collected on into your room that one so you can control your length of the light rays also how much length it will becomes increasing to that and how much brightness it will be takes to inside this and which color of the light ray you can be make down so if I get uh, oh my goodness the light yellowish it looks the gold flooded like uh, being a god comes into your room how oh, which way <laughs> you can imagine like this that is very cool so here I prefer the white so angel light good one right so once I prefer from here I can make shimmer you know about the shimmer right that one is going to shimming the light rays then the texture and everything I increase the super duper length then I make a little bit fall down on the rays that is very 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 increasable but it's very good this one is very good I actually I love this then the light source you can increase the light size so nothing but much more the threshold is very very good once you've done this you can click your done button so within the second of the clicks you can make this magical light inside this and nothing but one more thing if you can add some molecules of the particles or something you can achieve the original realistic good light will be there so I created the one single empty layer then click filter coming to render clouds right uh, the simple second one you can check it to the noise add a noise will be there right so make it simply you can create here empty layer and apply the background with the black once you apply with the black coming to the filter going to the noise add noise you can add some noise will be there so this is too much of noising I applied 18 to 20 percent only then I click OK actually this one is very cool so you can see this right the grain, rice, or air molecules or dust particles you can see you can tell over anything so then I comes to my screen mode once I put back in the screen so you can watch out these things so the same thing the second click of the one I take my polygon tool ever first fucking so I cut it down to those layers actually not cutting I just making my mask so once I come here I just apply it on this one then invert it by pressing command I to take invert this one then you can play around with the opacity that's very cool to make these things see I press command zoom in this is the hundred one hundred percent and this is the 20 to 25 percent 30 percent that is very cool so now you can see this without molecules and with the molecules some dust particles or any other molecules in the air substance you can capture your DSLR so they have to ask if somebody looks into your video they will ask you whether you have to take a real shot or if you can the Photoshop seriously so comment me in the videos and everything please share my videos and everyone's 
and watch out the next tutorial on my channel thank you bye bye see you